Welcome back to Solid Cam Pro. In this exercise, I'm going to show you how to create this curved pipe with the flange in Autodesk Inventor. And uh, for the dimensions, we have this drawing and we are going to create our model according to this drawing. So let's start. Select new project and select sketch. Select front plane. Now we are going to create this sketch, this one. So we have um, the height from this point to this line, 32 millimeter, radius 20, and the height from here to here, 62 millimeter. So let's create this sketch first. Give a dimension. 32 millimeter sixty two millimeter twenty millimeter. Now select fill a command, give a dimension of twenty millimeter, like this line and this line. Now our sketch is fully defined. Finish sketch. Now select YZ plane, create new sketch. And now we are going to create this sketch. So we have the height 62 millimeter and radius 20 millimeter and we have this 30 millimeter from here to here so try line give a dimension of 30 millimeter 62 millimeter select fillet command and give a dimension of 20 millimeter select this line and this line now our sketch is fully defined finish sketch now select 3d sketch and select intersection curve this one and select first sketch and the second sketch and select ok Perfect, finish sketch. Now select plane and select this point and this line. And create new sketch. Select project geometry and select center point. Hide this plane. According to the drawing, we have this outer diameter 15 millimeter. So let's draw a circle and give a dimension of 15 millimeter. Finish the sketch. Select sweep command. Select this profile and select this curve. Okay. And now select mirror command, select this part, and select this one, and select mirror plane, YZ plane. OK. Now hide this sketch. And now select shell command, select this face, this face, and this face. Give a thickness of 2 millimeter, select OK. A 
11 millimeter diameter as we see here we have 11 millimeter now select this surface and create new sketch select project geometry select this and select this now we have this radius 13 millimeter and let's draw two circle 26 millimeter in diameter select this and this equal Let's draw a construction line. Select this line and convert to construction line. Let's give a dimension from the center to the center, 66 millimeter. So let's draw another circle. select vertical constraint select this center point and select this center point now select arc select tangent command and let's give a dimension of 5 millimeter radius Now select trim command and here we have two wall diameter 4.5 so let's draw a circle 4.5 perfect actually we can delete this one this circle even this circle and now we can use mirror command before mirror command let's draw a line construction line convert to construction line 
now select mirror command select all these circles perfect now draw a line select tangent command select this line this circle tangent it's already tangent perfect select trim command and trim this circle perfect and again select uh, project geometry and select this outer circle now finish sketch so extrude five millimeter and select J perfect and now we are going to create this flange this one and we have outer diameter 25 and the inner diameter 20 millimeter and we have the distance from here to here 9 millimeter so the distance from this line to this edge 4 millimeters so we have this thickness 5 millimeter so let's create a new plane here select offset plane and select this surface 9 millimeter give a dimension of minus 9 perfect create new sketch now select uh, project geometry and select twenty millimeter and twenty five millimeter finish the sketch let's hide this plane select extrude command and now select up to this surface so join okay again select this profile and give a dimension of five millimeter perfect okay So here we have chamfer one millimeter and we have chamfer here and here and here. So let's apply chamfer mm, in this one 1.5, 1.5. So let's select chamfer, select this one, this one and this one give a dimension of 1.5 apply next we have two millimeter here chamfer 
and one millimeter here. Perfect. And here we have this radius fillet 5 millimeter. Select fillet. Give it a dimension of 5. Okay. So now let's apply material. Perfect. Now our model is finished. I hope you like this video and for more video and more project in Inventor, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching.